Like most African songs, this one tells a story. It was written by a young man from the Congo, a latter-day troubadour, Edouard Masengo. As is the African custom, he has recorded most of his life and times in song. This one is simply a letter of greeting sent from another land to his cousin Bosco in Katanga, telling him he is safe and well, but that one day he'll be back. Salamu yangu natumia baba Bosco Salamu yangu natumia baba Bosco Nani na mwenda njia yetu ya evile Salimie baba Bosco wabayeke Masengo niko sasa uku Kenya Siku moja nitarudi kule kwetu Edward Masengo lives now in Nairobi, the capital of Kenya, a thousand miles from the home he left in Elizabethville three years ago. His father was a leading magistrate there, a respected member of the community. But, perhaps wisely, he never pressed his son to follow in his footsteps. Edward, one of seven children, received his education at a local missionary high school. Tell me, Edward, when did you learn to play the guitar? Well, I first studied to play the guitar when I was about 11 years old. My father, who was a very strict man, did not like it very much, but he realized music was in my blood. So he let you practice then? Yes but I knew school was a very important thing for everybody. So to encourage people to become educated, I wrote one of my first songs called Kumbe Mjinga Ninani. Which means only fools refuse to learn. Kumbe Mjinga Ninani Nini wa vijana Ni yule asieji funza Nusu ya masomo Kweli Tateswa sana umu duniani Kwa kupa tatu zola ke Fungu we ni macho njini Kwa bibi zetu Dunia inakwenda mbio Kwa kupa tafura Pate ni nusu ya akili Muwe watu kweli One ni wenze nusu Na vile unateswa wewe kijana Wezako wali ojifunza wako mufuraha Na wewe nenda kumasomo nenda ujifunze Ukawe na we na fura For the present time, Edward seems settled in Nairobi. He's married a lovely girl from the Maasai tribe, one of the proud nomadic people who until now have held aloof from European ways. But he assures me he hadn't his wife in mind when he wrote Habari Gani Mpenzi. What's wrong, my love? The day we married, we agreed to love each other. Today, we have a little row. You get angry and you want to pack your bags and go home. It isn't my fault, it isn't your fault. But I have no job, and what are we going to eat? Habari gani mupenzi Siku ya ndoa yetuwe Tulia gana Urafiki Alafu leo nini Mata takidogo tu Na sirika na kufunga vyombo Siko salangu, siko salako Ulofa wangu, tutakula nini Siko salangu, siko salako Ulofa wangu tutavanini Aba 
Marigani mupenzi Siku ya ndoa yetu e Tuliagana Urafiki Alafu leo nini Mata takidogo tu Unasirika na kufunga vyombo Siko salangu, siko salako Ulofa wangu, tutakula nini Siko salangu Siko salako Ulofa wangu Tutava nini And where to next, Edward? I don't know. For the moment, I am happy here in Kenya. But someday, no doubt, I shall be getting into safari trouble again. Who knows? Perhaps this time to Europe or North America. And what about the Congo? Ah, yes. One day, I will go back. Dia yangu ya nyomi nyere Ya mubeseka, ya mulupango Dia yangu ya nyomi nyere Ya mubeseka, ya mulupango On leaving school, Edward went to work as a clerk and apprentice to a jeweller. He began to learn about precious stones and their value, whether an article was real or fake. But whenever the elderly owner wasn't looking, he would compose songs about anything that came into his head. In this case, it's the story of the old jeweller. One day, the old man came to see what I was typing. When he saw I was writing a song, instead of him letters, he was so hungry, he gave me the sack. So I wrote a song about his unfortunate affair. <laughs> Zamani sana nilikuwa ndombe Nilikuwa naandika mabarua Ya kwenda kubulaya na mashini yangu we Nilikuwa naandika mabarua Ya kwenda kubulaya na mashini yangu we Muzungu yangu alifika Ali niuliza unafanya nini Aliona pali pabarua Pali pabarua niliandika nyimbo Ali ni tosha, ali ni tosha, ali ni tosha na kazi yake. Ali ni tosha, ali ni tosha, ali ni tosha na kazi yake. Although he got the sack, Edward was quite a philosopher and wrote about the age-old problem of finding a job. Don't refuse work, he says. It's hard enough to find. Don't turn anything down, even if it's just cutting the grass. Bipi bipi buana, bipi bipi bora 
pesa Kazi yote buwana Hata mubaya e Kazi yote buwana Bipi bipi bora pesa Kazi yote buwana Hata mubaya e Kazi yote buwana Bipi bipi bora pesa Kazi yote buwana Hata mubaya e Kazi yote buwana Bipi bipi bora pesa Edward wasn't out of work for long because he used to wander around the bars playing his own music which people loved to dance to for hours and they always laughed at his lyrics which were topical but then one evening Edward was on his way home but let him tell you I was strolling down a street in Elizabethville on my way home playing my guitar naturellement when I was arrested for disturbing the peace I was taken to the police station there, the chief of the police listened to me play and said, let the garçon free. He is only making people happy. So what was more natural then than to write a song in praise of Brigadier Kabwebwe, the chief of police? Kabwebwe, baba, kabwebwe, kitambala. Kabwebwe, baba, kabwebwe, kitambala. Taomba kwa konini kabwebwe Ulini payote baba kabwebwe Masengo wanaimba kabwebwe kitambala Nili omba chupa moja unanipa chupa sita Na omba chupa moja unanipa chupa sita Na omba majikweli unanipa lemonade O baba kabwebwe kitambala At 19, it was a time for fun, adventures, and serenading girls. The particular girl of Watu Usiku broke his heart. At least that's what he says. Watu Usiku Hulala Mimi Huketi Nalia Niki Mukumbu Kampenzi Maneno Alio Nyambia Watu Usiku Hulala Nalia, Niki Mukumbu Kampenzi, Maneno Alio Nyambia. Penzi wangu na kuwasa, Penzi wangu na kulia, Penzi wangu na kuwasa, Penzi wangu na kulia. Watu usiku hulala, Mimi huketi nalia Niki mukumbu kampenzi Maneno alio nyambia Watu usiku hulala Mimi huketi nalia Niki mukumbu kampenzi Maneno alio nyambia Mbezi wangu na kuwasa Pezi wangu na kulia Pezi wangu na kuwaza Pezi wangu na kulia Watu husiku hulala Mimi huketi nalia Niki mukumbu kampenzi Maneno alio nyambia
From being a broken-hearted troubadour, Edward became the leader of a small group, the Je Coquet, Jeune Comique du Katanga Elisabethville, or the Young Comedians of Katanga. They were the first African group ever to sing in the European Regina Hotel in Leopoldville. Did you have a signature tune, Edward? Oh, yes. You'll be very surprised. And so were the young European girl when we sang it. So he kept it short. <laughs> I'm gonna buy a paper door just to call my own A doll that has a fellow's can no steal Either as I have a paper door that I can call my own That never fickle my end a real lover girl <laughs> Now I know why they were surprised. One of the most popular numbers the Je Coquet sang and Edward wrote was Three Qualities of a Woman probably because they sang it in French, Swahili, and Lingala, one of the main languages in Leopoldville, so everyone could understand. By the way, Edward, what are those three qualities? First, not to talk too much. Second, not to be jealous. And most important, they must not go working with another man. <laughs> After their successful opening, the group started to travel. Stanleyville, Camina, Coquillatville, over the Congo River to Brazzaville. They met with all the discomforts of artists on tour. Sometimes they had no beds and slept out under the stars. Often there was just the confusion of travel. As Edward explains in his song, in the Congo you drive on the right, up in Kenya you drive on the left. Sometimes you pay in francs, other times in shillings. The different food upsets you, it's just a mix-up. It's safari tabu, safari trouble. Kumbe safari kueli tabu, kumbe safari kueli tabu. Tulikuwa kuetu kongo, tunatembea kume. Tunafika Nairobi, tunatembea kushoto. Kumbe safari kueli tabu. Kukongo twalia ugali, Uganda walia matoke. Kukenya twalia ugali, tumbona yoni matata. Kumbe safari kueli tabu. Kukongo ni falanga, Nairobi ni shiringi. Kukongo ni falanga, Nairobi ni shiringi. In the moments of leisure on safari, Edward would play for his own enjoyment and his companions. What better relaxation than to sit after dinner listening to a typical Congo rhythm, a drinking song written by his cousin called Masanga.
The music of Africa changes wherever there are different types of people, different tribes. On his travels, Edward Masengo came across coastal music with its Arabic influence. It's sometimes mournful, written in a plaintive minor key. And without more ado, he composed something in that style to please the local people. It's called Risala Wa Kisani. The world has no secrets. And sometimes you wake up with a shock at two o'clock in the morning and realize you're in someone else's house. Then you are chased out into the night. <laughs> Salawa kisauni, risalawa kisauni, fikiria kwa hamza, umwingie rohoni muake, uzidi kumueleza, ameni ya chaga fulani, onagopo kunitoza. Ina mambo, dunia haina siri Hatekiwa sana ne usiku Utafukuzwa bahazani Risala wa kisauni Risala wa kisauni Fikiria kwa hamza Mwingie roho ni mwake Uzidi kumueleza Ameni ya chaga fulani Ona robo kunitoza Na robo kunitoza In all emerging African countries today, life is an incongruous mixture of old and new. The old are confused by new ideas, sudden changes of customs and methods. For the young, things can't change rapidly enough. And everywhere, it's politics, 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 even in song. Edward wrote this in praise of Tanganyika's leader, Julius Nyerere. The years go by, and what have we been waiting for? We've been waiting for the day when we shall all love each other. You be our leader. And we, the people, will follow you because we love you. Miaka na miyake kwena pita Bado muna ngoje ya nini Siku ni siku ikwena pita Tupenda ne wote Miaka na miyake kwena pita Bado muna ngoje ya nini Siku ni siku ikwena pita Tupenda ne wote Buwana nyerere utu angoze Na sisi raia tunakupenda Buwana nyerere utu angoze Na sisi raia tutakufuata Miaka na miyake kwena pita Bado tunangoje ya nini from african politics to other influences the catchy calypso melodies that have traveled their way around the world and become popular in every language. Edward sings Jamaica Farewell in Swahili. <laughs> Kukuta futa 
tena moyo wangu asumbu kabure juu ya mapenzi yangu mimi siwezi tena sheri tukuta futa tena moyo wangu asumbu kabure juu ya mapenzi yangu mimi